Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Once again, it is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys, as always. Today was freaking crazy. For any of you that watched my vlog, you saw that I said I was going skydiving, and obviously I am alive because I am posting this video. We went up to 14,000 feet, guys, and jumped out of a plane while I was connected to some dude that I'd only met a couple, like an hour before. Um, so it was crazy. It was such a rush. I can't even go into the feeling. It was just absolutely insane. I've never experienced anything like that before. Um, but since I am here and alive, guys, I'm going to try and post a really quick video for you guys. Um, I'm going to show you all a defense replay because I know some of you have been asking, like, hey, how does the aerobat, how does the arrowhead base design work? Um, is it effective for you? Whatever. Um, but the whole point of a farming base, obviously, is to protect these main storages right here. Yes, we do have these storages over here, but there's just not enough room in the middle um, to effectively protect all of your storages. So my main goal is protecting these four storages. So why don't we go ahead in here, and you can see this defense log at the top. It was a full attack by the guy, 15 giants, 6 wall breakers, etc., etc. You can read the rest. Um, I find it kind of interesting that he had a healer and a healing spell, but... Whatever. As you can see, he only got 50,000 in resources and only 46,000 gold. If that was my raid, I'd be pretty annoyed. Um, he did get 19 trophies, but hey, I don't really care because the whole point of this base, again, is just to protect my resources. So why don't we go ahead and replay this and um, take a look at how well the base um, and the base design does at protecting those storages in the middle for me. Um... As it loads in the sky's pot, we see that he attacks from right down here at the bottom. Um, it's only a minute and ten tack. So he drops those off. He uses that healing spell immediately. I don't think that's smart. Um, he should have saved that a little bit. But he drops those guys in there to do work. And then here's where my spring traps come in, which I love. Um, there go a couple of his giants. And as they continue to work their way around, um, they are going to run into more spring traps on the way to that other defense. So that's awesome. That was the exact intent that I had with putting those spring traps right next to um, to the defenses. So as you can see, they are working their way in. They just got my Dark Elixir, which is fine. I might move it over to the other side of the base because I generally do get attacked from this side more. Um, but as you can see right now, almost all of his giants are done. His archers and everything, they're working their way around the outside trying to get percentages but they're not really making their way in to the good stuff, um, which is the resources, obviously. So they just took out the town hall. There's the 50%. Um, as you can see, everything on the outside is destroyed, which is pretty general for an attack. But this guy was definitely going for the middle because, as you saw, he used his wall breakers. He used his giant. He used his barbarian king, who is dead right there. But if we look at this, we see that there's an entire elixir storage right there. And then everything else in the middle is still intact. So B from, oh my, I'm not even going to say the name of his clan, that's ridiculous. Um, so this guy did not um, do a good job at all of getting my resources. My base worked just as it was supposed to in order to protect my resources for me. Um, that's exactly what I wanted to do every single time. Um, let's see, I might take, I might take my Dark Elixir and... Um, Let's see, I think I'm actually going to take it and trade it out over here because I've, I haven't been attacked from um, from the left side like this, right over here. I haven't been attacked from there, so um, it might be a little bit safer right there. As you saw in the replay, he didn't even make it to that. Um, so, But all that means is that I need to put this spring trap right in here. Let's make sure that I have all of my defenses out. I do. Um, so yeah, guys, that is it. As you can see right now, update. I am updating my Barbarian King to level 4. Um, and yeah, just really trying to upgrade my walls right now um, because my clan is doing a trophy push soon in Golgotha, so I'm excited for that. But guys, I just wanted to show all that defense replay for the arrowhead so that everyone could see that it does effectively protect the core of your base. That guy only got 50,000 in resources. I'm perfectly fine with that. But let's close this video out, guys. Um, and I will see y'all later, alright? So, as always, y'all are so awesome. You're so much cooler than me. Keep calm and clash on, guys. I'll see you later.